Hello, uh, good morning. Uh, good morning in this uh, first uh, dev vlog, dev uh, blog uh, on the project um, B Girl made for the last uh, UE4 gym. So uh, according to the uh, to the team of transformation, I decided to uh, create a superhero able to transform itself in different things in different way or like uh, putting uh, get uh, some uh, accessories like uh, Iron Man a bit or a bit like Atman transform the size so yes first maybe you you have seen this this is B man this is the first uh, version of the project so it was the guy with uh, you know uh, black and white outfits but finally i got a lot of problem uh, making the animation blueprint because uh, this is a um, make human um, this is a make human um, object at the base the basis which we which was import to blender and then sent to mixamo and <laughs> uh, between these steps uh, something's uh, wrong happened and this gave me a lot of bad things for the the animation i don't know why i decided to stop this version and start a new one and the new one is bigger so bigger is um is a, is, a, is a superhero so i uh, model her uh, on blender 3d which is a very very cool uh, software and big girl is uh, so so this is a superhero and i gave her big hands like uh, uh, like uh, as you can see this is a uh, things really uh and full for uh, fight game fighting games because uh, you have to give big uh, big um, big hands and big um, hood to your character in order to to, to have more lisibility more uh, lisibility on the uh, different actions okay so here is the here is the model so she will be the main uh, character of the the game and uh, so i i uh, i create a lot of animation a lot of a lot of um, i create uh, two materials so normally it should be some things really um i would say uh personalizable or oh, um, um, uh, 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 I would say uh, customizable, yeah. So uh, this will be a very customizable um, character. Let's go through the blueprint. So this is the blueprint of the at the moment of the of bigger. So there is a simple add movement input through an axis input. Uh, using the get actor rotation, get the yaw, get the forward vector, and then you you got the forward vector, you got the forward and back, and there is the right vector for the right left, uh, the turn using the add controller yaw, the pitch using the the the, the add controller pitch uh, through uh, the mouse, so you control the direction. You control the direction with uh, the mouse and with the button forward you go forward then but yeah and after you have the camera turn around this allow you to deactivate the spring arm because yeah thanks to the spring arm you can turn the um, the, the the character in any in uh, in all um you can turn the character i don't know why he's here <laughs> uh, do, 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 this tech 
good this is a bit uh, like this yeah so thanks to the spring arm you can turn the the character in every way but you have to deactivate the spring arm in, a, in order to turn the character like this let me show you yep so this is some things you some effect you can get when you deactivate when you change the the when you change the options on of the camera so you just have to go there and go there and here off like this like this yep so here we go like this and jump yep but this is not what I wanted like this and yet so here we we go so this is big girl hmm? as you can see she can go everywhere and when i push the w button i can turn like this i can turn the view and then w again and then i can Okay, she can uh, transform herself thanks to the size up uh, function. So this is uh, I use the input uh, tra uh, transformation set in the project settings, and then with a timeline and a lab vector, I transform this. This could appear a bit complicated. I know this was something that I I have to learn a lot of. I have to take a lot of time to understand. But this timeline is really helpful for the alpha using, you put that in the alpha just by making zero here, one here on one second. It means the transformation will last just one second L like this. So yeah, she can transform herself. And this do not uh, change much the, um, the view the view follow the transformation and I can untransform myself and again and again yeah this is the first transformation the, there will be more transformation after um, well, uh, I use a 1D uh, one, 1D uh, blend um, blend anim so uh yeah there is the hider there is the work and there is the run i can set the speed in the anim instance at any moment but for the, for the moment i just leave the leave that like this okay uh you can change the interpolation uh, Normally, if you put something like this, you should. Yeah, she will. She, see, you will see her walk a bit, but yeah, this is not. You can. This there is more simpler uh, way to do that. Just changing the the speed. It's really easy, really really easy. You just have to go in the camera um, the character movement and set the speed so that's it for the moment this is a big girl there is no level but uh, soon there is w there will be more huh? yeah ah yes and she have uh, some fight movement yeah yeah that's it See you again.